funny how the story goes Little hope but bigger dreams uh, They try to bring the sucker down Singing louder than the crowd Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are gonna do another cook and clean with me. These are pretty popular and a lot of you guys have said that you like watching them so I am gonna do another one because I really enjoy filming them and I really enjoy cooking and cleaning and all the above. So today we are doing another cook and clean with me and this video is sponsored by HelloFresh. So I'm going to be using HelloFresh to cook tonight's dinner. One of my least favorite things to do is having to cook in a dirty kitchen. So I like to have all the dishes cleaned and out of the sink and all of the counters wiped down before I get started cooking, just so I have a clean slate to work with and I don't have to worry about any kind of clutter that's gonna stress me out or overwhelm me while I'm cooking. So like I said, we are using HelloFresh for dinner again tonight. We love using HelloFresh and we use them all of the time. We live very busy lives as do many of you as well, I'm sure. So we love using them because it's just super easy. Everything comes pre-packaged, pre-portioned, delivered straight to our door. We don't have to go to the grocery store. We don't have to meal plan. Any of the stuff is just super, super easy and all of the meals turn out delicious. Tonight we are making these pork and poblano tacos. We're huge fans of Mexican food here, and so this one was a really, really fun one to try. Another reason why we really like using HelloFresh is because these recipes are not things that we would typically think of to make. This one has a special spin to it that you will see a little bit later, and so these are things we just normally wouldn't even think to try to make, and so it's really fun to experiment and try new things. And we always save the recipe cards in case we want to recreate this on our own later. So the first thing that I'm doing is washing all of my produce. So I'm starting with the onion and I am having peeling and then thinly slicing the onion. And then I'm mincing a few slices until I have about a tablespoon of minced onion. And now I'm moving on to the poblano pepper. Don't be alarmed by the poblano. These peppers are actually very mild. So first I'm coring and de-seeding the poblano and then finally chopping it. Next I'm finally dicing the tomato. And then I'm peeling and thinly dicing the kiwi. The kiwi is that spin I was talking about earlier. It is not something I would have typically thought of to put on a taco, but it was actually really, really tasty. Now I'm roughly chopping the cilantro. And lastly, I'm quartering the lime. 
I'm not sure what happened. I think that I just forgot to hit record on the camera, but all of these ingredients that I just prepped, or at least most of them, are going together in a bowl to make a salsa. So combine tomato, kiwi, minced onion, half the cilantro, and a squeeze of lime juice, and then season with salt and pepper. Now it is time to cook the veggies. So heat a drizzle of oil in a large pan over medium high heat. Add the poblano, sliced onion, and half of the Mexican spice. Then you're gonna cook, stirring occasionally until soft and lightly charred for about three to four minutes. And now it's time to cook the pork. So to the same pan with the veggies, add the pork and another drizzle of olive oil and then the remaining Mexican spice. You now cook, breaking up the meat into pieces until the pork is browned and cooked all the way through, about four to five minutes, and then season with salt and pepper. So now it's time to finish the filling. We're gonna reduce the heat under the pan to medium low, and then stir in the stock concentrate and two tablespoons of water, and then also one tablespoon of tomato paste. And then you're gonna cook and stir until everything is coated in a thick sauce for about one to two minutes and then season with salt and pepper. We are almost done. So now it's time to warm the tortillas. You can either do this on a pan or you can wrap the tortillas in damp paper towels and then microwave for about 30 seconds. So now it's time to plate the tacos. I've divided the tortillas between the two plates and also divided the meat between six tortillas. And now we are topping the tacos with that salsa mixture that we made a little bit earlier. To top it off, I am squeezing some sour cream on top of each taco, sprinkling with cilantro, and then also a squeeze of lime. That is it, these are the tacos. They were so good, I would definitely make these again and again. It's a recipe I'm going to save. So if you guys wanna check out HelloFresh for yourselves, I'll have a link in the description box below. Go ahead and click that link and then use the code SIMPLYA80 for $80 off your first month of HelloFresh. Now that dinner is all done, it's time to clean the dishes and then clean up the rest of the kitchen. So one of my other favorite things about HelloFresh is the fact that cleanup after dinner is usually super minimal. They usually only require you to use like one pan when you're cooking and a cutting board and then that's pretty much it. So cleanup is usually super simple after we use a HelloFresh meal, which is another reason why I love using them. So I have loaded up the dishwasher and then there's a few things that I like to wash by hand. Um, knives are one of them and then also my pots and pans. So next I am going to clean out the sink.
Now that the dishes are done and put away, I am going to wipe down the countertops. And now I'm using some glass stove top cleaner and then the soft side of a sponge to wipe down the stove top. Another thing that I'm going to do tonight is wipe down all of the stainless steel in the kitchen. This is something I typically only do about once or twice a week, but it is such a satisfying thing after I have done it because everything in the kitchen just looks so shiny and fresh. The last thing that I'm gonna do is vacuum up the floors. And that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys are enjoying these cook and clean with me's because I certainly am enjoying making them. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of the videos that we have coming up. Follow us on Instagram at Allie underscore Gooch to keep up with us there on a day-to-day -day basis. And if you guys want to check out HelloFresh for yourselves, use the link in the description box below and then use the code simply 80 for $80 off your first month of HelloFresh. I love you guys so much and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Need nobody else but me